Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how you can fix your Valorant graphic driver crash or your Valorant crashing issue on your device. So I'm going to be showing you step by step procedure on how you can fix it. Make sure to stick with us till the end and follow the instruction as guided. So I'm going to be showing you a different method on how you can fix it. First thing first, make sure that the device is connected to an internet service and also make sure to stick with us till the end of this video. So to begin with, first of all, you need to update the graphic drivers. In order to update the graphic drivers, what you need to do is click on the search bar and then type in device manager. After you tap on device manager, open it up. On this interface, you need to locate the screen adapter. So right click on it after you find it and click on properties. As you can see that the display adapter is completely up to date so click on OK. And following this procedure you might be able to fix the issue. And if not you can check the minimal requirement to run Valorant. So then you need to check the properties of your Valorant. So in order to check the properties you need to right click on the Valorant, click on show more options and click on properties. After that you'll be able to see all sort of information such as this and make sure to go through it and click on compatibility. Once you're on this page, make sure that you've selected run this program as an administrator. If not, then make sure to tap on this and after that click on the apply button and click on OK. Once you've done this, restart your PC and you might be able to fix and once again launch your Valorant and you might be able to fix your issue. If none of these seems to be working, you can also lower the Valorant graphic. In order to lower the Valorant graphic, you need to head over to your settings. For that, click on the settings icon. After that, you'll be taken to the settings page and in the right hand side bar, you'll be able to see display. Just click on it or tap on it. And on this page, you also need to check the skill and layout. For that, select skill and in the right hand side corner, you'll be able to see recommended. In your case, if you don't have recommended, then click on this arrow icon and then select it on recommended. And once you've done this, check the display resolution as well. Also for this step, make sure that you've selected recommended. What else you can do is you can simply click on the graphic right over here and scroll down a bit. And right over here, you'll be able to see Valorant. If you're unable to find it, then just tap on browse, which is right on top. After that, locate the folder where you have installed Valorant. Once you've selected the Valorant, right click on your mouse and click on the option button. And right on this page, you need to make sure that you've selected high performance. After following all of these steps, if you're still unable to fix it, then the last alternative would be to delete or uninstall your Valorant application and then reinstall it. In order to uninstall it, click on the apps button in the settings page or you can simply head over to your control panel as well. So once you're on this page, you need to click on install app which is right on top. Now you'll be able to see a list of apps that is installed on your PC. So from here, you need to locate Valorant. After you locate the Valorant, click on this three dot icon next to it and click on the uninstall button. And once again, for the confirmation, click on uninstall. Wait for some time and then reinstall the application and try login into your account. This might be able to fix your issue. So these were the steps on how you can fix Valorant graphic driver crash or Valorant crashing issue on your device. That is all for this video. I hope the video was helpful. Make sure to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.